Today, we shall study the animation of inanimate objects. <gasps> Observe. <laughs> Good cheer. Now, jump. Roll over. <laughs> As you can see, I have animated the chair to obey and respect me. <laughs> Down, chair! <laughs> Who is there? Show yourself. Oh, Enchantra. I didn't realize you had such a hard time controlling your magic. <laughs> Hello, Spella. You know her? Only a little bit. She is my sister. <gasps> Here's the situation. I'm a combination. Magic and divine. No need for explanations. Endless demonstrations. Magic and it's mine. I can never shout what it's all about. When we were making a stink spell, Enchantra tripped over her own broom and fell right into the potion. <laughs> <laughs> My sister could barely take two steps without falling over, which is why whenever anybody fell down, we called it doing an Enchantra. <laughs> <laughs> Your aunt is so much fun. Uh, I suppose. We really do not see her that much. Aunt Spella is kind of a wanderer, and we never really know when she's going to show up. I wonder if any of you would enjoy doing a treasure hunt. Oh, <laughs> yes! Okay, first item Spella wants us to bring to her is the toenail from an ice giant? Where are we supposed to find an ice giant? I think it found us. <laughs> Distract him while I try to give him a pedicure. Distract him with what? You went with Butterfly? I know I can't help watching those things. And apparently neither can Ice Giant. <laughs> Nailed it! Okay, the second item is a tear from the eye of a rock monster. <gasps> How are we supposed to make a rock monster cry? Maybe if we take away its teddy rock? It's sooty what? It's teddy rock. Teddy Rock? Teddy Rock! I lost my Teddy Rock! And now that I have this, the rock monster can have that! <laughs> Teddy Rock! Okay, get ready. Item number three is on the way. Coming through! 
a collection of such odd things. <laughs> oh, I have to stop her! Sabrina, you are quite the young witch. Unlike my sister when she was your age. Wait! Sorry, sis. You're an eternity too late. <laughs> What's going on? Those items you brought her are for a spell. A very dark spell. My sister has been in power long enough. It's time for someone else in the family to take a turn. And this world has never been big enough for the both of us. I shall banish you to a place from which you can't return. <gasps> Along with the young one who has the potential to be as powerful as you. Oh no! She means me! Together is stuck in our cafe. After all these years, are you still holding a grudge, Selma? It's Zelda, and yes. Well, I am no more happy to be here with you and Holly. Hilda? Then you are to have me, so... <gasps> That's weird. Salem usually likes strangers. Maybe he's afraid she's gonna treat him the way she used to treat the two of us. Nonsense. I was always very nice to Zeppo and Helga. All right, you worms. There are going to be some new rules around here. First off, everyone must worship and obey me. Mm. Okay, so really only that one new rule. <laughs> Isn't she impressive? That's not the word I was going to use. So fierce and authoritative, even more so than Enchantra. Oh, an old warlock like this one can't help but admire that. Well, a young half-werewolf like this one isn't planning on putting up with it for very long. What is this? Your serving tray. This place is about to open, and we're going to need to tell people you work here as a waitress, which means you'll need some different clothes. You almost look human. <gasps> How dare you? Hey, your first customers. Hmm, they had better tip well. Tell me what you desire and then be gone. Uh, she's new. What do you have? Um, we'll both have a muffin and maybe some orange juice. I shall conjure two edible baked goods for your consumption. Uh, by conjure, she means get them from the kitchen. But you can go ahead and pour them their juice to start. Yay! Oh! That is odd. I expected a container to magically appear in the air. Uh, that is how things work in... Where she's from! Where they have a lot of cups. You reopen the portal! Yeah! I want my mommy back! I mean, the school needs its proper director. The school has its proper director, and she will not accept insolence from any of you. <laughs> Lesson number one do not question the teacher's judgment. <laughs> I've got to find a spell to get Enchantra out of this place and back to Witch World. Hmm. Enchantra, you can't threaten to turn the delivery boy into a toad just because he's late with the blueberries. 
There are rules you need to follow if you're gonna fit in. Fit in with the niches? Uh... Ugh, never. Oh! Hey! This spell is exactly what we need to open the portal. Well then, it's a good thing that you found it. To do this spell, the victims of the banishment, that be you and I, have to gather the human world equivalents of the three things they found in which world. Which means that you're about to get a tour of Greendale. And I am so looking forward to that. Do they have ice giants in this wretched dale you call green? No, but with the circus in town, we do have something kind of like it. That! sure it's gonna just hand as one of its toenails. Then I shall have to persuade it. Give me your paw. Aw, oh, that's a good kitty. Oh yes, you have been most helpful. What was item number two? A dragon scale. So I wonder if some fur from that dog named Drago would work. Then I shall obtain it. What? Excuse me, teenage nuisance. I desire some fur from your domesticated canine. Oh, I do not have time for this. Hey! Sit, Drago. Stay. Drago and Chandra! Here, boy. Here, Chandra. Stop that. No! Untangle me this instant. I will after I get some of what Drago is shedding. Two down, one to go. You can't keep us chained up forever. Vera Lupa is correct. Although she might be able to, Spella is very powerful. Your complaints have become tiresome. I do not wish to hear you anymore, nor do I want to deal with any of your friends. I'm sorry, I can't hear you. Which means that it's perfect. What's going on? The students were becoming disobedient. Children really should be seen but not heard, but I've tired of seeing them as well, so... Where did you send them? to the farthest reaches of the school where they can waste away in that impenetrable containment and never bother me again. <gasps> Come now, we shall write a song about my greatness. Hmm. Okay, the last thing we need is the human world equivalent of a tear from the rock monster, which means we're looking for some sort of stone-hearted beast. Like her. We can easily scare a tear out of that. Perhaps as the result of a confrontation with the Nocturne Beast. That won't work. Tiffany's not afraid of anything. <sighs> but I think I know how to get a tear out of her. Miss Titan, I want to apologize for all the trouble that I've caused. You want to apologize? Yeah, for running in the halls, being late to class, and breaking all of your very reasonable rules that really are for my own good. And I want to turn my life around by becoming a school security officer, just like you. You, you want to be me? You really are the perfect role model. I... I don't know what to say! Yeah, yeah, I'm emotional too. 
I'll leave you alone. I'll let you cry it out. <laughs> hey! No running in the halls! Oh, I hope this works. But if it doesn't, table four is waiting for their muffins. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <clears throat> Aim your wands and go! We did it! Good, then. Let us get out of this horrific world. Yeah, we're really gonna miss you, too. It is so good to be home. Let the battle commence! Why isn't everyone in Witch World gathering here to give adoration to their new queen? Did you forget to send out the announcements? <laughs> Hello, sis. Good skies! How did you make it back to this world? We did a spell, with a little help from Sabrina's aunts, Heidi and Zippy. You're gonna have to work a lot harder if you want to get rid of a witch and a half like us. Yes. You two are more powerful than I realized. There is no way I can defeat you alone. Fortunately, now that I'm ruler of this realm, I am no longer alone! <laughs> it's so good to have friends in dark places. <laughs> Four against two? Doesn't seem like a fair fight. Yeah, this is not at all going to be a fair fight. Well, there you are! Oh, I'm afraid I was wrong about Spella. My admiration for such a powerful and assertive woman has turned into a great fear of that powerful and assertive woman, and she has to be stopped. If I can first figure out how to get you out of this thing. Ah! <sighs> We're not going to be able to beat these things all at once, but... I've got a bright idea. Get it from the other side. Pull him tight! Ah! <laughs> Like Rocky wants to play a game of a rock paper witches, and paper beats rock every time. We're gonna need to work together on this. <laughs> you lose. Those two cannot be allowed to decimate my minions. Defeat them! Any idea how to battle against those? Yep, you and I are going to go for a double. Is that all you've got? One was too hot and one was too cold, but that was just right. And now, let us finish off some unpleasant family business. Okay, Spella, now it's a fair fight. Believe what you want. <laughs> we need more magic! You really think that you are stronger than I? I have been preparing for this what? battle for years. And now that I am more powerful than my sister and her useless underling, I will rule Witch World forever! <laughs> Not so much forever, perhaps. You? How did you free them? That container was invulnerable to every kind of magic. Yes, but not to this. That thing popped like a cheap balloon. <laughs> My 
brother was right. You really do need to learn how to share. No! <gasps> I am tired of playing with my sister. Would you like a turn? Sure, I'll take a swing. I suppose I should say thank you. And when you do, I'll say you're welcome. Perhaps we can just move on as if the words were already said. But they actually weren't said. Spugent! <laughs> All of us should act as if none of this unpleasantness ever occurred. She's never gonna say thank you, is she? I didn't think so. So, is what your sister said about you true? I mean, did you really used to be a klutz just like me? Come now, can you imagine me as anything other than graceful? <gasps> do you need some help getting up? Of course I do not need any help. Let me know if you change your mind about that help. Leave me be. <laughs>